What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the Let's Play. So, I did not just a little bit, but a lot of bit of grinding. We were like, I don't know, 26. So now we are around 35, 36 with everyone in the party. Um, This took like an entire day of just kind of, you know, setting everyone to just auto attack. And just grinding while I, uh, while I messed around with some other stuff. I'm learning uh, some... Easy to use ish editing software, uh, just Blender for video editing because I don't have anything else. Um, it's basic, it works. I'm doing it for a project for the future. But yeah, no, I uh, did all the leveling, got my characters up a bunch just so there's no doubts, hopefully, no doubts, um, in this battle. So now uh, let's get to it and see how well we face against Crystalinda this time. Oh, hopefully the uh, ho hopefully it matters. We were we were getting pretty stomped before. Oh, also, um, everybody is in anti-freeze gear. I'm just pulling out all the stops here. I'm I'm not taking a chance. Oh, there. <laughs> it's gonna skip straight on to the battle. Okay, I need everyone on a follow orders basis. <laughs> you, multi thrust. Multi -thrust! Spells. Boom, full on me. Oh, big damage. <laughs> Yeah, no, that tickles us now. Spells. What do we got? What do we got? We got something good from you. We have a uh, hymn of ice. Makes us even more resistant. Like that, she's just down without even much of a fight this time. You love to see it. 8,800 experience with 7,000 gold coins. Not as much gold as what we've lost to her in the last episode, but hey, it's a start. And another level up. Oh, goody. Ooh, multi heal. Okay, here goes. <clears throat> Pella, Mella, Fell and Feller. Fabula Ferocious. No, stop it. P please, anything but that. Helter, skelter, bind and belt her. Anima atrocious, Liba, claustra, cabalistic, hex. Hmm, I wonder how this word is pronounced. Snorri, what kind of scholar are you? Pull yourself together. Ah, uh, yes, I remember now. Liber, claustra, cabalistic. Hicks Bialy Dosus! Oh my god. <laughs> no, oh no, please forgive me. I'll do anything. I'll change my ways, I promise. <laughs> Yeah, 
all the ice is gone. Look! The ice! It's melting! And everyone just moves along like nothing ever happened. What about the people around the little, like, dial thing in the center that was all, like... You know... They seem to be scared running from something. Your Majesty, is it really you? Hmm? Oh yes, I remember now. The witch trapped me in that book and pretended to be me, didn't she? Thank goodness. For a moment there, I was worried the ordeal might have muddled your memory. Fear not, Your Majesty, the witch is sealed away once more. Your Majesty, we've been searching for you everywhere. Please, you must come back to the castle. The Chancellor is beside himself with worry. Hmm. Thank you so much for saving my kingdom. I must see to it that you are justly rewarded. One orb of great magical power, please. That's all I ask. You need the blue orb, don't you? I heard you talking about it from inside the book. Come and see me at the castle. I will gladly give it to you. As for the grimoire, Snorri, why not give it to me? Hold on a minute, Your Majesty. I don't think you understand just how dangerous that book is. You should let us take care of it. <sighs> Um, yes, of course. Yes! Another orb to add to the collection! Come on, let's go to the castle and get our reward. Here, I'll let you keep hold of this. I mean, what am I going to do with it? Well, no matter. We can finally use the town. Gotta say, though, I didn't think that amount of leveling would have made her a complete pushover. But I don't regret it in the slightest. Because it means I'll be level. <laughs> I won't run into a problem for probably a while now. And that means we can just keep chugging along, so... Not even mad. Let's see what they got here. Ooh. White shield. Don't you look cool? Reduces fire damage. Nice. Not sad, none of this stuff, uh... Like, it's good stuff. Um, I don't think I have the money for it. I guess I do, but... Let's check out the weapons first. Ooh, Zombie's Bane. Got a cool holy sword. I am trying to get Sylvando up to dual wielding, so that would be pretty cool for him to have. Ooh, 93 with the 2%, and then we got a... We deal ice damage. Rips into a group of enemies with 
sharp icicles when used as a battle item. Oh, cool. So it's just an ice version of the uh, fire sword that Silvando has right now. And it's a knife. Sprigdrasil! I don't think I've, like, upgraded her all that much. I mean, it's a huge upgrade, and I should give it to her. So. We got this shiver stick. Let's see. Oh, okay, never mind. This is a... This is a paralysis sword. Wait. Hold on. What kind of sword are you? Are you... You don't look like you're a two-hander, but I think it is. Huh. I mean, I want my... Oh, it is a greatsword. Durst, it says right above it. Okay, that's actually kind of cool. Um. Yeah, we can go ahead and get this for, uh... Ah, oh, no, that'd be all my money. No... I don't know what I want. We'll get this for Sylvanda just because it looks cool and it's not that expensive. Yeah, put it on. And then uh, we'll get this for Serena. It's a shame I don't have Veronica using whips. I think that's all I get for now. Let's take a look. Okay, that's kind of cool. And then Silvando. Ooh, that is a nice sword. Can't wait to get him dual wielding and then have him using that in the fire sword. So. What else do we got here? We have an inn. Wonder, hello, hello. You must have sailed a very long way to get here. Before you leave, you must go and see Queen Frizabelle. Her Majesty is very interested in broadening her horizons. I am sure she would be thrilled to speak with a well-traveled fellow such as you. Yeah, that's the plan. say anything at all. Why? Did you hear something? I thought so, but... Well, never mind. It must have just been my imagination. Come on, let's go. Yeah, I wonder what the voice was. Consider me interested. But let's go claim our final orb. Oh boy. Can I get into these rooms? Yeah, boy. Oh, it's an elevator. Don't mind me. I can't open those yet. Hey, Mini Metal! Let's go. I almost have a full collection of those, I believe. Ooh, see a sorcery. I love that the first intention when ever walking into a new place, like a castle, is just ransack it for all of its loot. Let's 
like he hit. Ooh. Oh, Lunari. Cool. Uh, hello. Ooh. What do we got back here? Can I talk to you? Nope. Sniffleheim is a peaceful place, but ever so often somebody will break that peace and we must punish them for their crimes. This is where we imprison such people until they pledge to change their ways, and they nearly always do. It's almost like magic. I mean, if I was stuck in a cage like this, I, I mean, yeah. It doesn't even have a couch. Like, I, I ain't about to hang around there. Which I guess that's kind of the point. You don't deserve luxury. But like something would be nice. And we get another password. This is the Room of the Revival via the Altar of the Undeciphered. Okay. I don't know how many of these I have. Nobleman's Knife. Ooh, that sounds awesome. Oh, it is awesome. Dashing dagger that can increase MP and sometimes send humanoid monsters into a spellbound stupor. What? Beguiling humanoid family monsters when attacking. That is amazing. Yeah, well, I don't want to replace this one. Yeah, no, shoot. Pretty cool looking. It's not even upgraded. I wonder, what would it say that Eric's uh, best offensive would be? Nobleman and Swordbreaker. Oh, that would be pretty cool for him to run around with. I like that this one has two attacks, though. Like, so it, it's not much... Sword, Swordbreaker's not much stronger than it. We'll stick with those. You fool! Huh? Huh? Hm. Oh yeah? Well, if I'm a fool, then what are you? <laughs> What's the matter with you, Veronica? I didn't say anything. Yes, you did. Didn't you? Hmm. Something funny's going on around here. Let's get in and see the queen before anything else strange happens. And let her take you for a fool. It's not who she claims Don't tell me the queen is still stuck in the book. Oh no. That's the feeling I'm getting. The queen is still stuck in the book. Thank you, my friend. If not for you, Sniffleheim may have remained frozen forever. Her Majesty is eager to offer you her own personal thanks, and your reward, of course, will you find you will find her up the stairs. I got a bad feeling about this. I, f I feel like the queen is still in the book. Ah, excellent. You came. Let me present to you the blue orb of Sniffleheim. If you will just come a little closer. Yep, that that right there. You just come a little, little closer. from the book oh, 
please. You have to listen to me. I am the real Frisabelle. The woman in front of you is the witch. What? Ridiculous. She's the witch, not me. Don't believe her lies. Hmm. Trick us once, shame on you. Trick us twice, shame on us. You might not like being trapped in there again, but you'll just have to get used to it. No, you're wrong. The spell didn't work because Snorri paused in the middle of it. You have to believe me. She's lying. The Wicked Witch is trying to trick you again. You have to believe me. Everybody, calm down. I have been Her Majesty's tutor for ten years. If anyone can tell the real queen from the imposter, it is me. I will ask one question to both of you. Whoever answers it correctly is the real Queen Frisabel. Here is the question. What is the true treasure of Sniffelheim? The real Frisabel would remember her father's teachings well. <laughs> That's easy. The true treasure of Sniffelheim is clearly the blue ore. What else could it be but something so valuable? Hmm, the orb, you say? Very well, very well. Now then, what is your answer? The true treasure of Sniffelheim is its people. Though the bleakest blizzards assail them, ever do they warm these frigid climes with their ardent hearts. Precisely! The very words the royal family have passed down through the generations. The real Queen Frisabel is the one in the book! No! She's a liar, you fools! You imbeciles! Can't you see? Curse you! Oh, yes. Very queenly. Fine. You caught me out again. I surrender. I surrender. <laughs> oh. 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 I wait all that time to get my powers back, and you make me waste every last drop on escaping that wretched book again. My magic is spent. My life is yours. Boil me in a cauldron, burn me at the stake. Just get it over with. Men, take her to the dungeon. <clears throat> Wait! Your Majesty, what are you doing? That is a fair question. Why would Her Majesty protect the witch who tried to destroy her kingdom? Could she be under Crystalinda's control? But her eyes are clear and lucid, as she, uh, she seems to be in her right mind. Well, there is only one way to find out. Let us us hear what she has to say. Queen Frisabel, please! Step away from her. She says she has lost her powers, but how can we know for sure? She is a witch. It is in her nature to lie. Oh. Everyone, listen to me. It is true that Kristalinda did something unforgivable when she froze this city. But we spoke from time to time when she held me captive. She listened to me. 
She even helped me to understand what it is to be queen. Hers is not a bad heart. And the time I spent in the book, it gave me the chance to think. To ready myself to truly rule at last. Please, I believe her when she says her powers are spent. She is not a threat to us any longer. We must let her live. Hmm, she seems convinced, Snorri. Why not give Crystalinda one last chance? Very well. You are the ruler of this kingdom, Your Majesty. If that is your decision, we will gladly follow it. <laughs> Must you be so nicey, nicey, Frisabel? You're making me look bad. Crystalinda, there's something I still don't understand. Why did you free Sniffleheim in the first place? Oh, that was a favor for a friend. The splendid specimen who released me from the grimoire. As you know, I was trapped in that dusty, fusty library for a horribly long time. Oh, it was so, so boring. Then, three months ago, he appeared. He took down my book from the shelf and spoke to me. I will release you from your prison, but you must do something for me in return. For a beautiful boy like you? Anything. Free me and I am yours forevermore. What is your desire, my pretty? You must freeze Sniffleheim. When you do, a great hero will be sent to save the city. One who wears the same pendant as I. His name is Hendrik. And when he arrives, I would like you to kill him. So I did as he asked. And when the great hero arrived, I decided to have him run a little errand for me before I disposed of him. To slay a mighty beast that just happened to have stolen my powers. And, well, the rest you know. The same pendant as Sir Hendrik, eh? And what was this handsome young fellow's name, might I ask? His name? Oh, I haven't a clue. He disappeared after he freed me, and I haven't seen him since. It's a shame. He was such a pretty little thing. Hmm. Thank you once again for all you have done for me and my kingdom. The orb is yours to do with as you see fit. King receives the blue orb. Well, I'm sure Hendrik isn't going to be fond of uh, learning Jasper's out to kill him. But your majesty, isn't the orb one of your kingdom's most precious treasures? Are you sure you don't mind us taking it? Don't, don't, don't ask that question. We need this to save the world. Of course. As my father always said, the true treasure of this kingdom is its people. And if not for you, they may well have been frozen forever. Well, if you insist, best of luck with all your royal duties. And try not to let the pressure get to you, okay? <laughs> oh, don't worry about that, little girl. Frisabel will be just fine. I plan to take very good care of her. The rainbow starts to glow brighter than ever before.
King's Orb collection is complete, head east through the Sneerfell and climb through the first forest to open a path to Yggdrasil. Okay. Well, now we know where we're headed. Alright, just gonna save here and wrap things up for now, so... Now that we are finally done with that, we have all the orbs, we can go ahead and, I guess, uh, head on east now. Through the Sneerfell, make our way to Yggdrasil, pop those orbs into place, and see what the tree's got in store for us. So, until then, see you all again, and remember, stay wholesome, my friends.